Thank you, Anna. I'll just a few things. You know, I'll introduce the family. I love your boy. He was like a little brother to me. And I would do anything, and that was one of the many things that would gravitate me towards him. I said, I was, I was a couple years older than Troy, boy. But he was good friends, best friends with my younger brother, McCaw, who is now serving time for what he, you know, for his things. But I just like to say, this whole five years, I have not been partying. I have not been doing these things that you guys accuse me of. We, me and my family behind me, we stand strong together. And if I could offer you guys any word of advice, lean on your family as always, and seek Jesus first so we can come to a core. But I really true hope, no matter what happened today, justice not gonna be served if the wrong man is away. But I do have a great deal of remorse. I have an emptiness myself. I never got to mourn your son, my brother, my friend. Instead, I had this light shining upon me for five years, not just me, my family. But we're here today, and we truly understand that not, nothing is in our hands, nothing is in your hands, Your Honor, but it may be, but we leave it all up into a core. He is the final, the Alpha and the Omega. And i just like to say to my family watching and my family behind me, just keep your head up, keep your heart strong, guys, because this is not over. The battle is lost, but the war is not. Fall on him, guys, and all will be all right. Again, thank you, Your Honor, for this time. To my family and friends, head up, heart strong. And to the family, I hope you guys get what you guys seeking. But it won't be here. It may not be when you want it or when I want it. It's all on a course time. Thank you, Your Honor.